Yo what's up guys it's Aptrix here finally the first ever PlayStation 3 emulator for Android devices has launched and this is a real PS3 emulator for Android and not any fake clone versions or using Windows emulators this PS3 emulator for Android lets you emulate PS3 games natively on your mobile device and is known as a PS3e it stands for Android PS3 emulator you guys might be thinking that this is a clickbait video well no guys i'll just go and launch this emulator and as you guys will be able to see God of War 3 has already been added i'll be talking about how to set up this PlayStation 3 emulator on your Android devices and what it actually is. Now if we just go ahead and take a look at the about section you guys will be able to see that APS3e is a PlayStation 3 emulator for Android devices which uses your system graphics driver. Now this emulator launched just today and it is an ambitious project because it literally bypasses all the additional overlays such as needing to use wine based windows emulators and running RPCS3 emulator etc. No guys this is not like Anstation PS3 emulator this works completely natively ensuring you get the maximum performance possible and here are the minimum requirements for the APS3 emulator the best PS3 emulator for android currently under development you need at least android version 7 or above vulkan support which i think is only available in android version 10 or above along with that arm 64 bit processor that's about it and this is being developed by a chinese developer they also have their own official github page for this emulator but currently it has been made private for some reason after this emulator was launched nonetheless in today's video will be setting it up so let's get started first of all you'll need to make sure to add the aps3 emulator on your android device afterwards tap on the open button when you open it for the first time you'll need to allow a single permission and once that has been done your emulator will successfully start the next step will be to simply tap on these three lines and you don't really get a very complex ui the first thing which you'll need to do is import ps3 firmware inside this emulator now this is the same firmware which we use with rpcs3 emulator by sony on their playstation 3 page anyways we'll just go and tap on this button afterwards make sure to select your ps3 firmware once that has been done you'll need to wait for a few seconds until this process has been completed and that's about it afterwards you can directly start importing your playstation 3 games that you have added on your android device and select the third option which will let you import your ps3 games so here let me just go ahead and try importing sonic game it finished loading instantaneously now i'll just go ahead and tap on refresh list and as you guys can see sonic cd trial has been successfully added here and these are legit playstation 3 games not ps2 or ps1 games it's very unbelievable but fine Finally, a real working PS3 emulator is finally here for Android devices. Now when you open the game for the first time, it will 100% crash. Don't worry, it's not an issue with your device. It doesn't mean your device is incompatible. You just need to open it for the second time and then it will start compiling all the shaders, PPU models and everything else that happens similarly in our PCS3 emulator as well. So right here, just be patient, tap on the X button. And another amazing fact is that your games will not crash inside this PlayStation 3 emulator. That's how much stable it actually is and as you guys can see the game loading progress is almost complete now and here we go our first playstation 3 game has successfully started inside this emulator this is unbelievable guys and you will be able to see all the joystick etc actually works i am not using any sort of translation layers like wine this is completely natively being emulated on our android device just like any other playstation 2 emulator ps1 emulator ps vita emulator and so on we'll just go ahead and press the x button to start our game and here we go as you guys will be able to see we are seeing the first cutscene we'll skip through it and there we go the game has successfully started it is running at almost 60 fps because just take a look at this it's a very smooth experience i think it might be capped to 30 fps actually because it might be console level but it literally feels very smooth just take a look at this so yeah this is 100 real playstation 3 emulator for android devices we'll be testing out our next game that is going to be god of war collections now yeah the ps2 god of war games i know but we'll be testing out god of war 3 in a separate video that will be coming out tomorrow where i'll be testing out games like the last of us god of war assassin's creed gta 5 and lot more so be sure to hit that like button subscribe turn on all notifications because amazing videos are heading to your way pretty soon and immediately as you guys can see our ps3 god of war game is about to start there we go santa monica studios and this is really awesome guys i'm completely speechless here we go our game has successfully started and you will be able to see it managed to render everything towards the end now we'll just go ahead and press the new game option and select the difficulty and you will be able to see the loading sign as well now i'm unsure if this is based on rpcs 3 emulator or not because the developer hasn't really revealed much the size of this 
the simulator is only 28 MB and as you'll be able to see uh, all the cutscenes are being loaded properly without any issues the game is running pretty smooth and I'll be testing out a lot of games inside this PS3 emulator so it's your job to let me know in the comment section down below which game should I test out on this PS3 emulator for Android you guys will be able to hear the audio output is also working properly So yeah that's pretty great here we go guys our game is about to begin and uh, when i tried out this same game inside the olympus emulator it crashed as soon as the cutscene was over but with this ps3 emulator for android let's find out if our game works if it crashes or not in my opinion it will not crash because this is the first official playstation 3 emulator for android devices so here we go the game has successfully started and as you guys will be able to see it is running super smooth god of war collections on my android device a real playstation 3 title by the way just take a look at this all the attacks etc animation it's running so smoothly on my snapdragon 8 elite processor android device and surprisingly enough guys my device is also not hitting at all which really means that this is very optimal optimized in terms of emulation so i am very excited to see what's next for this emulator there are a couple of features which need to be added the first feature will be the ability to save game the second feature should be an fps bar or performance meter the third update can be of improving compatibility later on in future but yeah guys this is the first ever ps3 emulator for android which actually works so that's going to be it for today's video thanks for watching hit that like button subscribe turn on all notifications stay tuned for the next videos i'll see you guys next time peace out